Welcome, everyone. I'll just give you a moment to get settled in Zoom. Um, and then we're going to jump right in to our conversation with uh, Nadav Lapid, the director of Ahedzni, um, which we played here at the Other Israel Film Festival last night. Um, thank you all for joining us. Thank you for coming in this morning. I know Nadav has a short window um, with us for this Q&A, so I want to give a big thank you to Nadav for joining. Nadav, thank you so much. Thanks for inviting me. And um, I'm going to jump right into some questions. Folks, if you have questions, and I'm sure you have questions um, from the film last night, um, please place them in the chat. And if there's time and uh, relevance, we will call on you um, and contact you behind the scenes. Um, so, Nadav, I want to start um, uh, by asking you what inspired you to make this film. Um, I guess it's a mixture of, of like uh, true events. I mean, some of the, or maybe the, the, the genesis of the film, of the, 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 the fabrication of the film, the creation of the film. Uh, well, in a way, I think you, you, since you watched the, the, the movie, so it would be familiar to you, but I, myself on April 2018, I got a phone call from a bureaucrat in the ministry, Israeli Ministry of Culture, a very vivid, nice, intelligent, uh, charming, devoted um, young woman who invited me for a screening of one of my movies somewhere in the Israeli desert in the in the Arava. And uh, at the very end, after we, we talked for maybe like, I don't know, 20 minutes, she mentioned the form that I should sign in order to detail the my intervention, etc., etc. Well, you know, you know, you know how how what 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 happens next. So this was this was maybe the the the, the um, I mean maybe maybe I'll, I'll say a, little bit, a bit more. It was it was like it's not like today the situation is great, but it was like really I think that the, the, maybe the peak of the the, the period of feeling of anxiety and, and oppression in, in, in the early cultural scene uh, where, where, where people were like were like uh, lowering their voice and whispering when they started to talk about more radical projects, whatever it means. Uh, 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 so for me, in a way, I mean, you, you, you didn't have to be Einstein in order to understand that this form is, is, is is what 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 is the, what is the aim behind it and 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 I remember that for me what what was really well all of this is in, is in the movie that, that I told this young woman I mean I told her I understand that you don't like things that are not yours and and she she automatically she she, she immediately she, she she replied yes I'm not very proud of what I'm doing right now that the situation is getting worse and worse. So could you please sign a form? Uh, I can send it to you by by email. And unlike the the, the main character, where well, I wasn't as I don't know as as uh, maybe as cruel or maybe as as courageous as the main character. So I didn't I didn't record her, and I went to the desert and I signed this 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 form, and I don't remember which stupid topics have, uh, did I choose. And from the desert, I was saying, sending uh, videos uh, uh, um, uh, to my mother, who was the, my film editor. We were edited, edited this film synonyms, and she was agonizing from cancer. And, and one month and a half later, she passed away. And maybe three or four weeks later, I started to write this script. So, 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 so this was maybe maybe the direct uh, genesis. But afterwards, I guess it's a little bit the description of of uh, what do you become when you live in a society, in a in a, in, a, in a sick society? And I guess that in a way all the societies are, or most of them are sick in one way or another. But in a sick society, where in a way you feel that the the the, the, the only possible choice is resistance and 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 struggle and 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 and, and, and insisting on your opinions, even even if the great majority is opposed to them. And you feel that you are surrounded by 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 hostility or by dragons or by monsters and or by enemies and slowly slowly yourself you become uh, 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 a dragon and a monster 
and you see only only everything become everything become charged i mean you the simple the simple simplicity of life everything you you, you don't see any more people trees sun you see only only um the con the context Sorry, I was muted. And would you say that um, that you yourself have become that dragon, have uh, been pushed to to the places that the character in the film why um, was pushed to? There's a beautiful sentence uh, that I read afterwards by by by, unsurprisingly by Nietzsche, when he's uh, saying something. I'm, I mean, I'm, I'm I'm like quoting now freely, and I'm sure it's better in originally, but it's something like he who um, he who fights against monsters should 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 be should put attention not to become a monster himself. And if you and if you look, if you observe too much time, uh, the, the 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 abyss, the abyss will look back at you and something like this. So for me, he wrote it about Aizni, like he didn't know, but he wrote it about Aizni. I think it's really it's really kind of kind of kind of accurate description of the movie and and and. Yeah, I mean, I mean, you know, I I think that out of being too many times right or having the feeling that you are right and the old wrong, you become terrible, even 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 if you were right. And 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 I think that for me, in a way, the movie is about all sorts of things, but it's mainly about what. Do you become? How do we become what we are? When 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 we live, maybe in a place that give you all only bad choices, only bad bad choices. Only I mean I mean in a way it's either being the 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 kind and the gentle collaborator, or the terrible and the arrogant uh, 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 um, distant. And and it's a little bit like 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 in this fable in this story that he told uh, that he's telling her at that moment about, about his military service. I mean, there are like three choices there. Like I mean, there are he who like there are there are there, there is the, the the innocent victim. There is the the tormentor, the devil, the sergeant, and there is the maybe future artist. Who serves anything from distant, but is not doing anything. The only thing that doesn't exist there is is the normal choice, the good choice. And 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 on this sense, I think no, it's not by accident that the movie ends with or not not end, but almost ends with this: be good. Because maybe it's a, on this sense, it's a certain way. It's a movie maybe about being good. I don't know if, if goodness exists in English, but something like this. There's, there's goodness, however, <laughs> a little further away. But um, it's very interesting. What do you make of, of and, and I think also there's a lot of, um, you mentioned Nietzsche before, but also Kafkaesque elements within it as far as, as, far as being stuck in a reality where you can't win. Um, but within all of that, I don't know if to call it irony, but... Um, I noticed that the Israeli film funds support a film about that's critical of the state. And these are the people that are often forcing people to sign um, a, a alliance. Um, does that make this film a weapon in their hands? Yeah. Actually, it, it would have been hilarious if the film really would have been financed by the Israeli film fund. But I mean, I mean, I mean, I mean, I mean, I mean, truly, what what happened is that 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 I mean, I mean, you know, my 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 all my films, all my previous films were financed partly, at least, by Israel, which is logical because I'm Israeli and I lived in Israel and I grew up in Israel and et cetera, et cetera. Uh, and since my and, and and my previous films, you know, names, you know, whatever it means, but it wants a golden bear in Berlin. So 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 there, there would have been a, there, there was a good case to. To ask for financing, but but with this movie, together with my French producer, we decided not to ask for 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 financing because because I had the feeling that it might be really really dangerous for the movie. I mean I mean it's not like I was afraid that someone will will 
with throw me to prison or something like this it's, it's not the state of things in israel but but there are many there are many many other ways to 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 put obstacles in 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 in, in to, to the fabrication of a movie uh, so it's apply for 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 support and only when the movie was finished selected to come we asked for for support from from several israeli film funds and the israeli film fund was was generous and courageous it it should be said however that they gave us 20000 euros which is 1.6 or 1.7 percent out of the budget of the movie so i wouldn't say that it's a movie financed by, by i mean i don't think that there, there has ever been an israeli movie that was uh, less financed by by by, by israel but um, even 1.7 percent is is more than nothing i think you can uh, you can write it off as not being it's a a um a a, a tool for Israel's propaganda. Um, I wanted to ask about the choice of the name and Ahid's knee, and in Hebrew it's called the knee, and and that whole element within the film. Why did you choose to explore her story and to put that there in that way? I think that that, that you know, for me, like 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 this, uh, Ahid Amimi thing. Uh, maybe it was based. It began like always. I mean, I must say that, that unlike all my other movies and most of the movies in the world that, that take time, the, the, the movie was done with a, with a crazy urgency. Uh, uh, it was written in the script was written in two weeks and a half. My previous film took about two years, one year and a half. This is, I think, averagely what it takes to write a script. Uh, uh, um, we we started shooting some months later so so everything was done a little bit like 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 in a kind of storm i mean i mean you know in one day one the night before i started writing the script i didn't know that i'm going to 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 do this movie and and three weeks later we were already heading towards like a pre-production uh, um so, so so what i'd like to say that, that that a lot of decisions were extremely instinct instinctive and then, and then and then you find reasons but you know it, it began with a kind of i guess the kind of I mean, since the movie, since in the middle of the movie, there's a film director, and the, 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 there are all these movies about artists where you, you know, painters that you never see what they're painting, poets you never hear their poems. I told myself, I'm curious to to know what 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 he's directing this guy. So so and then and then I came to 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 this idea of of, of a movie about Aita Mimi that, in a way, for me, beyond Aita Mimi, the, the person that I guess maybe not. Oh, the, this young militant kind of Palestinian gendarme for Palestinians and maybe Palestinian terrorists for Israelis. But uh, beyond the specific story of Aitamim, for me, it was really a, 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 between between art and politics, between 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 um, the, the the symbolistic and the concrete, between the 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 the, 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 the the majestic and the and the and the and the and the, and, the, and the real and the true. I mean, I mean, you know, when you see Aita Mimi facing his, uh, armed Israeli soldiers, you know, you you have the feeling that you watch a Renaissance uh, Renaissance painting, or, or 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 I mean, you feel like building a monument of of 100 meters or or, or, or making a movie. So 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 there was something. In this, in this, in this, in this meeting point, and of course, and and but there was also something else, you know, with this, with this quotation by this, by this, by this terrible Israeli minister Smotrich, who, who regretted the fact that, that that she didn't get a bullet in her knee in order to, to to be to be paralyzed for the rest of her life. I, I, for me, this beginning, this audition scene, it serves also like a little bit like how would I say it? It's like in legends, you know, legends that begin with once upon once upon a time, once upon a time in a kingdom. So for me, this is a little bit the once upon a time of once upon a time in a kingdom named Israel. There was a young um, Palestinian militant, militant who, who 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 slept a soldier and was thrown to 
to to to nine months in prison and there was a respectable minister who, who regretted the fact that she didn't get a a bullet in her, in her kneecap so this is this is the place this is the territory this is the geography this is the conditions of and now we are going to to send our main character why to this place and see what's going to happen it sets the stage. I, I think that's that's an interesting uh, way of presenting it and making that connection. Um, I want to. I know you're short for time, and I want to take a question from the audience. Um, Olga, I know you had a question. I was asking more about the content, but I, I want to say before Olga, because I know her question has to do with the cinematic side of it. The film feels. Um, I, I think it. It's it's very raw and breaks a lot of the I, I think like the way stories are told often in cinema and um and maybe this relates to to um olga's question um which i believe i have to uh, ask for her um which is i was wondering about the camera movements early in the film it's frantic there's no editing the camera just switches from one view to another why did you choose why is her question yeah, I think I, I mean I, for me for me I mean I mean I mean I, I I don't know to which extent you know you know my previous movies but in fact like in my movies the camera they're all always something very physical and doesn't matter but I think that here I felt in a way that 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 the 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 main the main role of the of the maybe like in all the of the the movies but the main role of the camera. And of the the, the audio visual work is to 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 reveal the truth the truth of the movie the truth the truth of each moment in the movie and the truth of each moment is the movie is that the movie that's what I felt is all the time a little bit like its main character on the edge of collapsing on the edge of shouting on the edge of of falling down on the edge of crying on the edge. There's something, I mean, I mean, there's something I feel so charged in this character and in the movie that that nothing is only concrete, nothing is only simple. Even the most uh, daily exchange of sentences, hi, how are you, are like a uh, declaration of, of war or, 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 or of despair. Uh, and, and, and I felt that the, the, the role of the camera is 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 exactly this is 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 to go beyond the simple the concrete the person walking in the in the desert because you know I mean, afterwards a film director who comes to to show his previous movies it's not exactly a mission impossible like it sounds very 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 whatever you know it's 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 it, 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 it sounds very basic very simple Osmond documentary and there was something the camera had to had to to expose the 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 basic the fundamental truth the fundamental essence of the thing so 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 it had all the time to detach the movie from 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 from, from, from its concrete level and it's not easy with the camera because the camera itself is a very concrete tool the camera is not like a it's not like in an exp expressionist painting when you could like van gogh when you can do like this i mean camera it's like it's a cold-blooded sterile thing you you put something in front of the camera you see it so in a way, I felt that, that I had to force the camera to be involved, force the camera to 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 leave its 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 initial position as a, as a, as a, as a, as a, as a, as a some nerve, something that is distant, something that is detached to 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 transform it to an actor. To to in a way, it's not by accident that the movie begins with, with rain falling down but it, it's not only that the camera is showing the rain but the camera itself get wet it was in a way getting the camera wet so 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 that's that's maybe part of the thing and i think it's very it's very suiting it creates in general you know, the, the wetness and the and and even the coloring of it all it uh, creates an atmosphere of of the world that our director is in one that is full of noise that's full of um tension um and i think it helps push him to that edge um can i ask one last question because i know you have to go um so our character you know, you you talk about his complexities, and he's you know he's a rebel and he's a demon. He's he is we're meant to admire him and to hate him, um, and in many ways, um, if he is our rebel, 
And if he's, are, are we meant to follow him as an audience? And I think about this not only within the Israeli context, but also um, films show internationally. And this film was at the Cannes Film Festival. Was our audience at the end meant to cheer for him or to not follow him at all? You know, it's a big. I mean, I mean, I mean, and, and and for me, it's a good thing. But 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 people people love this movie for ten thousand reasons and hate this movie for ten thousand reasons. As, as as you said, this movie, the movie was in Cannes. The movie won the the jury award, and it's and it's it. Show, I mean, now for instance, I mean, Sevilla. The movie is, is shown all over the world, and 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 what I, for me is nice in is that in a way the reactions of audiences are pretty similar. Uh, are pretty similar. I mean, I mean, because I mean, I mean, I mean, the movie, the movie, I think evokes usually like strong emotions, a little bit, a little bit like, 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 like its main character. I mean, I mean, he's, he's terrible in a way, but, but he's, but, you know, but he's also, Terrible because because uh, because he is facing terrible things. And maybe it's also, most of us are also and 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 it's and also, you know, you know, I mean the the, the civilized or the gent option in front of him is not is not finally a better one so so um because because you know i mean i mean there's something about him that 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 refuse to accept a kind of show of uh, but but in a way not normalize is a product of the place where he lives. I mean, I mean, is is he is is a part of the, of the disease that he's trying to heal. I mean, I mean, I mean, he's the victim. Is also the of the same same fighting against against. He's he's talking about violence. He's violent himself. He's is 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 talking about cruelty. He's cruel himself. But you know, but it, this is all. all or, 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 or always, I think the the, the labyrinth in, in 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 which, in a way, we find we find we find himself, we find ourselves. I mean, I mean, it's a little bit like 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 he's quoting his mother at a certain moment when she's saying that th there are no survivors here. I mean, everyone is 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 infected. Wow. Sorry for being so pessimistic. I'm, I'm not. I'm not. I'm not such a pessimistic it's person. 10, it's was, 10 a.m. here. You know, <laughs> we just had our coffee. Um, no, yeah, yeah. I, um, um, I, I think that's a part of uh, a lot of the films that we're showing at the other Israel Film Festival. Really bring up a lot of these important questions, and I think if nothing else, it's um, your film forces an audience to think about these questions. Um, I, I want to thank you so much, Nadav, for being with us and for sharing the film. The film is being released by Kino Lorber here in the U.S., and I want to thank them and look forward to their release and continuing this conversation and thinking about these topics um, with further depth. Thank you all for being a part, and we hope to see you more in person. Thank you all. Have a good day.